women's pursuit of sexual pleasure and strong desire for sex always becomes problematic since women's sexual desire is directly connected with their psychological wounds. As sexual desire and sexual actions are reinforced, wounds may grow too much, inducing sex addiction or perversion, as well as physical and psychological problems. Individuals have different thoughts, experiences, and perception, so they have different standards on the excess of sex ability. Whether you have access in sexuality or not can be determined only by your own standard. However, many women make efforts to develop sexuality in order to respond to their partner's speech and actions, and it may easily lead to excess. Excess here includes excessive sexual expressions, sexual actions, and obsession for sex. Then sexuality that used to give women health and happiness in the body and mind begins to cause stress and wounds in both women and their partners. It may also cause unpleasantness and distrust in relationships. Women must maintain harmony and balance among the body, mind, and sexuality so that they can achieve not only happiness but also sexual happiness. This is women's sexuality in a true sense. Also, every woman has unique and different sex ability. One's sexuality cannot be compared with other sexuality in any case. Women who let others know about their sexuality are considered to have the goal of self-display or seduction, which indicates that they don't have true sexuality anymore. Women with true sexuality can generate happiness and sexual happiness in their mind on their own, and they never compare themselves with other people. Comparing one's sexuality with others' sexuality is the manifestation of psychological wounds operating inside women's mind, and even having ideas about comparison grows wounds in them. As women's wounds continue to affect their body and mind, they become highly sensitive with respect to sexuality and may develop the delusion that sexual pleasure is sexual happiness and happiness in mind. It changes them to become women who seduce the partners and destroy the body and mind of themselves and their partners. Then they become objects of only physical sexual pleasure are taken advantage of by the partners, and their love and happiness are destroyed. When women become obsessive for their sexuality and sexual desire, they become selfish pleasure seekers who put priority on sex over everything else. Their life becomes filled with rage, violence, pain, and wounds, which may eventually lead to a drastic action. It is imperative that women take cautions against excessive sexuality. On the other hand, when women build true sexuality adopting adequate methods, women can achieve ultimate sexual pleasure regardless of their partners. Their sexuality operates in a positive way to make their body and mind healthy and charming. Women can and must build and activate true sexuality so that they can have one treatment ability, happiness ability, and true sexual happiness. No two women have the identical sex ability. It is recommended that you never compare your sex ability with others and never let anyone know about your sex ability. It is only you yourself who can recognize your own sexual pleasure in your body and mind and make you live happily with healthy and charming body and mind.